Frank Frazetta. No doubt. <laughs> Frank Frazetta is just the cornerstone of everything I understand of being a very strong, simplistic, kick-ass artist. His uh, mood, his sentiment, his emotions went directly into his brush strokes like no one I've ever seen. And he is, no matter how I put it, my first inspiration. I think what he, it seems like th that he has that spontaneity or intuitive go with it flow that I thought I could only do in digital work. It seems like he has that in oil, which is what I would have loved to see played out in front of me because people have said over the years to me, like when you they see the color roughs I do or the color tests, they're like, why don't you just finish them? Make them into real painting instead of having to go through the transfer process and all the, the, the elaborate things you do to make a clean and nice looking painting. Why don't you just continue on that and, and be more spontaneous? I just don't have the balls. <laughs> but Frank Facetta did. <laughs> The problem is I've never met him. I've never talked to him. And uh, I, a lot of the information I have on him is second-hand or through articles or people who met them. I think also he, he made all the preparations on an image ready so he could be spontaneous when he painted. And I think that's what I try to take into my own artwork is that make plans, make decisions beforehand, and when you start painting, have fun with it.